Good evening and welcome to all you footy fans out there. It's the ILFL Soccer Night Show live coming to you from NTV. I've got a full complement of guests with me this evening to talk about football. Yes, it's the football that we've got to show you, even though we're on a winter break. We've got no ILFL games for you, but your ILFL committee and veterans are still working hard behind the scenes. Sometimes they're pushing paper and sometimes they're playing football, raising the profile of the ILFL and also the veterans uh, who make up the majority of the panel and committee and the volunteers who bring to you the Inner London Football League each week. They decided to take themselves off on an excursion and they went off down to West London to take on the London Tigers vets in their own patch. Um, I'm going to turn to Cameras, the man who's at the chairman of ILFL. Good evening, Cameras. Uh, good day out. It was a really enjoyable day out. I think we need to thank Mesba and London Tigers for providing us the platform, first of all. But I think, you know, Nanu played, Hasnot played, most of the committee played. There, there were even people from, you know, um, Swindon, Milton Keynes, Watford all turned up. Excellent. It was a really, really good event. Very good event. Fantastic. And not to be outdone by all of you youngsters who run around on a Sunday, we decided to take a TV camera down to show you. So this could either be comedy or drama as we watch the ILFL vets taking on the London Tigers vets down in sunny West London yesterday. Here's the footage. The ILFL um, friendly game against London Tigers. They're all getting here ready. I'm going to jump on the pitch. Everyone's jumping on the pitch. Let's go out there and have fun.
Uh, and there you go. I know you saw it there as a 2-1 to, to the Tigers team. Uh, we actually joined that game in the second half. All of that footage was second half footage. It was actually 3-2 to us ILFL vets, but sadly, we lost it by four goals to three. Hasna, I'm going to turn to your end now. And um, you were playing in that game and you were part of the, the solid, strong back four that conceded the four goals. Were, <laughs> were they well-deserved or were they lucky? Well, you, you've got to give me some credit. I think the, the quarter of an hour that I came off to just get a breather, because it's, it's an exhibition game, it's a friendly game, so um, we were rolling on and off. Um, and that quarter of an hour that I came off, two goals were conceded in that time. Um, as you can imagine, uh, being a passionate defender, I was screaming my head off from the sidelines. Um, so, but you know what? It was great fun to play with vets. I'm, never gonna, I'm not going to class myself a vet for another three years at least. Um, so it was great fun to play with vets. And you can actually see that um, these guys that are doing football in the community, that, um, that, are, that are getting involved in so much of their own time to do these things, you can see that their, their intelligence in the game shows on the pitch because your stamina and your fitness isn't there anymore. I mean, it's, it's always going to die away from you, but your intelligence never goes. And I think that's what we saw. And you could see that, I mean, compared to what we have on our Sundays, ball over the top, um, you know, long balls, high balls, there wasn't so much. There was a lot more of the ball on the floor. Mm -hmm. There's a lot more passing. And there wasn't, I mean, it wasn't a case of sort of keep, take five or six touches before you pass. Everyone played intelligence level. So intelligence for me, level. for me, I enjoyed that because it, it, was, it was a level I enjoyed. Fantastic. Nani, would you echo that? I, I would agree with Hasnab. I mean, there isn't a single person or single player on the pitch that didn't enjoy themselves yesterday. It was really, really good. Um, the pace may have been absent, the sportsmanship may have been absent, but the skills and agility and the determination, it was all in there. It was really, really good. A great day out. And, um, you know, we should do that more often. It's just, it's just such a great thing, you know. I mean, it gets the community together, it gets people together. It's not just the playing, it's a social aspect as well that comes as a package. And um, we need that more. More often, true. Yeah. I need it more because I wasn't there and I'd like to get involved. Um, interesting something that Nanu said there about um, the passion, uh, the sportsmanship or, or lack of it. As it's something that's been synonymous uh, with the ILFL Vets League uh, that has taken part. And I know a lot of you can probably do a little bit better than what you've seen there. And I'm looking forward to the ILFL Vets League starting again. It will happen. We're going to give you some information on that later on in the show. You can also see the strap line that's running along the bottom of your screen regarding um, a minibus appeal for Bromley by Bo. Salam is here in the studio. He's going to tell you a little bit more about that in the next segment of the show. So stick around. We'll be back after this short break. अपना रेडिक्शन आईएलएफएल सकनाई